Hello everyone, today I would like to demonstrate a straight time log scape. Alright, but first I'm going to demonstrate uh, how, how is the correct way to apply and then how to defend. Please, can you down here? So we're going guys for the traditional straight time log from mount, okay? So right here, I have the mounting loop, I'm going to control his arm, cross. This is the way we learn. Okay, put my hand on the ground, a fist, approach the knee, bring the heel. Here's when, here's where most of the people make a mistake. They hit me down, they, and then they try to pass the leg over. We learn every Jiu Jitsu class, as a fundamental class, sorry, we need to pass the leg before we land back, okay? Otherwise, if I land back, okay, to pass my leg, he can follow me. So here's where I work on my skate. So, the correct way to apply, I need to make sure that as soon as I get this angle right here, if my opponent let me get here, that's it. Because I don't want to keep my hip back because right here he can move the elbow. I need to drive my hip forward, move the elbow, right now it's start. So this is the thing, I need to move before my opponent gets to this place. So go on top of me please. So look at the mount, okay? He's going to the arm lock. And remember, he needs to pass the leg before he goes to the arm lock. Go, everything, drive the hip forward, and then he can go back or just to meet him from there. Go. If I let him get right here, drive the hip forward, it's gonna be very hard for me to move my elbow. So come back, please. The right time, I'm going with him. Go, please. So I just got the same side, he, he's controlling my arm. This side I'm going to step on the ground and, and then I move my hip with him, go. So I move with him. Now look, my tracks is... Now look, I'm going to lock his, uh, his leg using my arm, okay, my tricep. So then I'm gonna uh, hold his collar right here to don't let him move. In no gi, you can put your hand right here. In the gi, you, you can hold the collar. So right now, guys, I'm going to try to go on top of him. But if I use my arm, it's gonna be very heavy. Again, I use my leg on the ground, and then I have to face into him. If I want to go to my right, okay, the same side he's holding my arm, I'm going to face my hip to the right. So I bump my hip, so I move. Then I go on top of him. Again, if you wait for him to get the angle before you try to move the arm, it's gonna be too late, okay? So he's going, move, control. Keep tight, please, use all, all. Yes, you shrink. Doesn't matter how hard, uh, how strong he is, guys. Right now, he cannot pass the leg over. Step. Then I go. That's why. Can I go on you, please? Once I apply the straight arm lock, I'm going here, okay? Even if you put the elbow there, the reason this escape is gonna work is because people throw the leg. You cannot throw the leg. Switch the arm hand on the ground, put your elbow there please, I'm going to lift my knee and then I close. Now, no way he can defend. So, if somebody do the straight arm lock wrong, throwing the leg, put the elbow, uh, put your tricep on your opponent's leg and then escape. Okay, thank you. Peace.